dual shock version, bro. <laughs> and I still have the dual shock controls. Oh, God sakes. Okay. Give me a second. <clears throat> Hit it. Let's see, yes. Analog joystick. R. This is PS1. That's why there's no analog. Why? Why? No idea. No idea. Uh, let's see. Rustic. This that's the new settings, and if it works, it's This is gonna be fun. Uh -huh. I should copy the controls if that's possible. And when is gonna be the tools drop? The one's gonna be the analog. Resident Evil 2, 2 version is a range mode. Mostly because this is the version I'll work with. Freeze! Boy! What are you doing here? Hold your fire! I'm a human! Save and clear it. Gotta shake this thing with the gamepad. Yeah. What is. PS. I got a PS4. What do you mean? Can I make another one? Hello. You know what? Yeah, let me check something out. Okay, the controls will never uh, extract the clear one. Three, four, 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 four,
So it clearly does work. I wonder how would it work in this game though, because whoa, wait a minute. Because this is supposed to be dual shock in this one. I mean analog. games would feel like this, you know, supposed to be diagonal, but instead of, you get this. Also, what is this supposed to be? Is this just Game Boy your plans so would it worse? Now back to the thing that I wanted to do. Why can't you skip cutscenes in this game? Why couldn't they make it like this? And you go on the VS and sell that game. They made this one because it's easier. That's what's fun, did it? Now that I have infinite ammo, bro. There is no need for bullets. You know, I need some, you know, one thing to say. I'm gonna take the world. Yeah, he's dead. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna get some more games to test this out. But until then, I'm very busy and I don't do outros. Okay. Mm -hmm. Listen.